What is up, you guys? It's your girl Queen Lulu with the Cocoa Butter Brown Skin, and I'm back again with another video. Now, before we get into this video, I'm gonna need to apologize to you guys for delaying to post videos on my YouTube channel. I know I haven't been posting for like the longest time, and I apologize for that. So, I am gonna be consistent with my videos, and I am gonna be making sure that I keep you guys updated. Now, let's get straight into this video. is on feminine hygiene now ladies we all know our kitty cat our vagina is a self-cleaning machine right we, we all know that right okay well now you know it Stop using stuff like soap to wash your kitty cat of soaps. They do tend to mess with your pH balance. I don't know if you knew that, but whoever advised you when it came to like periods and just taking care of your kitty cat, you guys will know that you guys are not supposed to drink or eat as many acidic and um, dairy products mess with things like discharge and all of those kind of things because we do get things like periods and everything like that that's one thing so i'm going to get into the products that i use to basically bathe myself i do tend to enjoy bathing more than showering because it's just more relaxing for me so the products that i like to use so when i bath i like to use something called cough salt so, cough salt is basically sea salt, if you guys did not know that. That would help. Okay, it's like bath salt. It's like the alternative version of bath salt. So, that's what I use, cough salt for. You guys will see this a lot in a lot of people's YouTube videos. The infamous <laughs> apple cider vinegar. So, apple cider vinegar is good for using as a toner, but you have sensitive skin please do a patch test so, be a nice and just apply it on your face because everybody's glowing and you wanna you know, follow the way that's it it is also good for bathing if you have any infections apple cider vinegar does help if you put it in your bath soak yourself in your skin and just it does help to take away that fishy Stench if you guys do have that. Um, but yeah, guys, it does help. It is a natural um, freshener for your vagina. So that's what our apple cider vinegar is for. It's very good, guys. Like apple cider vinegar helps with everything. It's just the same as Sanex, Savlon, Sanex, whatever. Whatever you use, Dettol, Sanex, Savlon, it does help. It's the same. It literally has same properties if I'm wrong correct me but it does have almost the same properties so if you do not have a savlon dental sanix then use apple cider vinegar as a alternative and another thing that is also good to bath with these two products your Epsom salt and your bicarbonate of salt bicarbonate of soda Ugh. Bicarbonate of soda is also very famous when it comes to removing odors. Any kind of odors, if you're a man, this is also going to help you. Ooh, it helps to soak yourself in it. If you guys have problems like odor problems, this is your new best friend. This does help a lot. A lot of people actually underestimate cleaning products um, in this also does help if you guys want to brighten your teeth. Put a bit of it and um, put your toothpaste. So once you put your toothpaste, just dip it in the bicarbonate of soda and brush your teeth. You will find that if you do that, don't do it every day because it is harsh. So probably use this twice a week. So do that method twice a week. And I promise. 
comes to you, you guys will see the difference within your teeth. Your teeth will actually go back to its natural color that it's supposed to be, which is almost like a creamy white. So there is this debate about whether or not you should shave your cubicle hair on a regular basis or if you just should just let it grow. Ladies, I feel like this is grow in humid dark places. So if you're gonna have cubic hair and you're wearing cotton underwear, you're wearing silk underwear, obviously you're gonna experience some uncomfortable situations down there. So <clears throat> if you're a person like me who prefers shaving the kitty cat, so what I do is, so you know those um razor marks that you after shaving um, your kitty cat so what helps with that is while you're shaving your kitty cat bath with something like Sanox why do I keep putting in Sanox? Savalon or bath with something like apple cider vinegar and you can also bath with uh, carbonate soda like it. please avoid please avoid wearing stuff especially after shave silk underwears or your Cotton underwear you can wear. You can wear cotton underwear. Okay, cotton underwear is very tricky because it does allow your kitty cat to breathe. Just if after shaving, like avoid wearing stuff like jeans for at least two days. Avoid wearing stuff like jeans. Um, avoid wearing tights. Just wear something that's gonna allow some air to maneuver around there. So another tip is to wear stuff like your lace underwears. Lace underwears are actually the best underwears for women because they have holes for your kitty cat to breathe in. I prefer going commando when it comes to sleeping. It does help for your kitty cat to avoid body odors and sweat because when you're sleeping you do sweat. Just avoid wearing stuff like um, your underwears. Um, just go commando. I mean, it's your safe place. It's don't wear any underwear. It does help. You guys will see the difference. It does really help. Another thing, ladies. A lot of people think that green tea is only used for slimming and if you're trying to detox your skin. No. Green tea does actually help when it comes to all the toxins out of your body so i like to use the slimming green tea you guys will find this at clicks this cam it's off the counter bag of teas so it is a slimming tea you guys can get there it's a slimming green tea what it does is it basically so if you do want to drink this if you do buy this okay so for you guys to drink it at night that way your tummy it will start reacting only in the morning whereas if you drink it in the morning you will gonna this is a serious situation let me tell you something you guys will have to go to the bathroom so many times don't underestimate this tea please don't underestimate this tea so if you like to detox your body if you like to in other ways um, this is the best tea for you um, but if you're if your tummy is very sensitive in terms of cramps and all I advise you not to drink this tea but instead to resort to the five roses green tea so this is a mint flavor it comes in different flavors there's a lemon flavor there's a mint flavor there's a apple flavor I prefer the apple flavor is very delightful. When it comes to shaving, after shaving, it is also a good thing to. If you're a person like me who doesn't, who likes to avoid things like rash, um, especially.
especially like when you've shaved your kitty cat is very sensitive so i prefer immediately applying coconut oil it is, you can also buy this at lifestyle this cam kicks very good okay especially if like you have lotion if you have dry skin um okay so what i like to do is i i don't have dry skin i actually have oily skin but i do like to have a very moisturized body skin. so what i do is i put a bit of this i warm it up for it to be like liquid because if you guys see it's literally like that so if you guys have coconut oil, you guys will realize that if you put it in a very um, cool place, it's going to dry up like this. And if you put it in a very humid place, it's